Hey superstars, welcome back to another video where I doodle a sports ball player and bug them through the mail for an autograph. It's been a while since I've done one of these. I got a pack of 92 score. I actually have lots of packs of 92 score for some reason, but I got this pack and I should be able to find someone to bug in here. And that someone's gonna be BJ Serhoff. Now I'm kind of nervous about this video and kind of excited about this video at the same time. I'm nervous because this autograph request was sent out over two years ago when I was just starting out with this YouTube thing. And it's hard to share this because I feel like the art is less than stellar. But at the same time, I'm very excited because I get to show off how much better I've gotten at this whole thing. It's not that I wasn't capable of doing what I'm doing today back then, but I think I've sort of found more of a focus and purpose and style and I don't know if any of that makes any sense. But in two and a half years, I really learned a lot about making videos and especially about making sports art. This doodle is okay, but it's not really up to par anymore. And at some point I wanted to make the art more impressive than this. And so I tell myself to get better every time. And while the results may vary, I can see that I'm definitely making progress and I make it a point to never really be satisfied either. So in two more years, I wanna look at some of the art that I'm doing today and I want it to make me throw up in my mouth a little bit, kind of like this doodle does. So excuse me, I need to go get a drink real quick. Okay, that's better. So it was two years ago, but if I'm remembering correctly, I picked BJ Serhoff out of this pack because he seems like a really neat guy. He played on the 84 Olympic team. He was the number one overall pick in the 85 draft, and he had just a nice, long, respectable career with good numbers and all that stuff. But what struck me most was that he and his wife have a son who is autistic, and they started a support group for families with autistic children called Pathfinders for Autism. So I packed up the doodle with the 92 score and an 87 tops future stars and I made a little donation directly to Pathfinders for Autism and then I waited two years wondering if Mr. Serhoff ever got my crummy little doodle. And lo and behold, we look at this. He kept that doodle for some reason. He signed my cool 87 tops card and the 92 score looks so much better with some ink. So obviously I wanna thank Mr. Serhoff, but I really wanna thank you guys too for watching me and supporting me for the last two and a half years as I developed this whole thing I'm doing. It wasn't always pretty, but it's always been a lot of fun and I owe that all to you. I know, I know, Scott makes another sappy video thanking his audience, but you guys really are the best and I mean that. So, you know the spiel, like, comment, subscribe, yada, 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 and we'll catch you next time, probably with some better art, hopefully. Mm -hmm.